So much of being a jewelry designer brings me joy. The fact that I get to work with my hands every day. Something also like is just seeing someone get so excited about wearing something. Even if I make a piece over and over again, when someone sees it for the first time, I mean that just is the best feeling in the world. I was always artistic as a child. I was also always very entrepreneurial, um, not just like painting seashells, but needing to start a whole business of selling them as well. I actually started making jewelry when I was 13. When my grandma passed away, um, I inherited a small bag of her costume jewelry and just kind of started taking things apart and putting it back together. And then I got into beading, which I like to consider as like the gateway into jewelry making. And eventually in college, I studied jewelry and metalsmithing and uh, business. So I work with a lot of rough gemstones. I like to celebrate the natural beauty of something exactly how you know it was made and intended. I'm really passionate about making like the best environmental choices as we can so we work with all recycled metals and I really like to highlight the beauty of imperfections hoping that the person who's wearing my jewelry sees a reflection of that in themselves. The whole heart collection is something I'm so excited about. I cut out a heart out of silver, cut it in half, and then solder it back together or fuse it back together with, with gold. So it's inspired from a Japanese technique called kintsugi, where um, something breaks, usually a piece of ceramic, pottery, and then you put the piece back together using gold. So it actually becomes stronger than it was before because gold is a harder material and you can see the break as a new part of the whole. In a sense, I hope that the person who's wearing it sees a reflection of you know all the messy breaks and whatever it is that you've gone through your life to make you you, that you celebrate even those hardships. Something that's really important to me is art into industry. It's a, a saying from like the Bauhaus school and I think that it's, it's really cool, especially with working like a company like Uncommon Goods, where you do sell a lot of products, but the fact that it's something that like we make from start to finish with our hands, that we're putting that out into the world.